give you a demo review of my Fender 68 Paisley reissue um, Telecaster and um, what I've done to this is I've actually had brass saddles installed and the pickups that I've got in here are a set of Don Mayer Super Sports with the um, S Tele neck um, pickup in the bridge is an overwhelmed version of his pickup and the thing about the S Tele neck is that it's designed to give you kind of a Stratocaster type sound in the in the neck of a um, a Telecaster and I found that it actually has more of a Stratocaster sound than some of the strats I've ever owned so he's definitely done a great job of capturing a, a vintage style strat sound in the neck so um, again this is through my Vibrolux I'm using a Barber LCD special recipe for anything ever driven this is the neck pickup the Esteli Clean <laughs> Definitely kind of got a stratty kind of vibe to it. Definitely has a more of a, a clearer sound than the typical um, Telecaster neck pickup. They're typically kind of dark sounding. And this is just very strat sounding compared to a lot of pickups I've heard. definitely rings and chimes like a, a typical Strat would. Okay. In the middle between the Super Sport, Super Sport Bridge and the Esteli Neck. <laughs> definitely kind of has a little bit of a quacky sound which is typically found in two and four on a Strat positions. Um, I mean, that's, it's a different kind of sound because you're using the bridge pickup along with the neck pickup. So it's not exactly the same, but it kind of does retain some of the qualities. <laughs> the cool thing about these pickups is um, they don't hum a whole lot. A lot of the um, humming is typically from the amp, which is a common thing with the type of amp I have. But um, the pickups are very quiet as far as a lot of single coils I've used. I've had very little issues with hum. The thing about the bridge is this is a little bit different than a typical Telecaster bridge I'm used to. I'm used to kind of the hard, kind of twangy kind of vibe. And I mean, it does that. But it also has this kind of rounded off kind of sweet sound that you typically find in a neck pickup. So... sounds like a um, if you were to take a neck pickup and put it in the bridge although it's not the case but um, it's got this kind of rounded kind of sweet chimey kind of sound to it that I don't find a lot in Telecaster bridges <laughs> definitely has a sweetness that I haven't been able to capture or have captured in any other pickup that I've used so it's a very cool pickup for that alone um, and so I'm going to try this with a, a little bit of overdrive this is the Esteli neck <laughs> of a strap pickup.
lot of a strat vibe to it in the neck. This is between um, the, the two pickups. <laughs> kind of quality of a Telecaster. And this is in the bridge position. Twang, but it's um, overall went rounded off in, in terms of the overall high end and everything, which is kind of cool to hear in a Telecaster. So overall, um, the cool thing about this guitar is, well, uh, unique is that it's a it's a basswood body, so um, it's in my opinion most basswood bodies are a little bit more pickier as far as what you put in them. Um, I originally had a set of DiMarzio, I had a Twain King in the neck and a Chopper T in the bridge, and it was okay for what it was, but it just almost seemed like it wasn't waking up the guitar and letting it kind of um, breathe a bit. It just didn't sound natural. And um, after doing a bit of research, um, Don Mayer has been, you know, doing all these vintage style pickups for ages. And as far as boutique pickups go, I personally prefer his pickups towards anything that I've used. Um, the only other ones that I've personally liked, um, it's a little bit different style of this, is um, the Bardens, which I'll, I'll get a video down of that. But um, for as far as a, a nice, sweet, vintage type tone, I think Don Mayer has really nailed it right on the head. So I'd really like to try a few of his other guitars uh, pickups. So, But overall, I've been very happy with it, and it's worth every penny to try and, and put them in any Telecaster you have. So, again, this was a uh, an Acetelli neck. You can specially order that, and then the bridge was an overround super sport. So, hopefully, if you're on the line about getting a set from him, I mean, he's a nice guy, so he'll definitely work with you to get what kind of tech you want. So, um, hopefully, this kind of helped you decide. Uh, hope you enjoy it.